Hey, 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 Leo. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This is for the week of April 25th through to the 29th. Uh, this won't resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below. Oh, only one that time. Leo, if you would, before you leave, I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're uh, utilizing that link in the description box, Leo, as there are scammers about the community. And know that you will always see my face in a reading, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Ooh, look at that. This came out together. Okay, let me keep them both though. All right, so Leo, your overall energy is temperance here. Sagittarius energy. Your challenge is the Earth Mother, which is the Empress here. Taurus energy. You have the movement of pentacles, the spirit of pentacles, the wheel of fortune, the Two of Cups, and the Five of Cups. And these came out together, which was interesting. But they want me to separate them. So we'll see why in a moment. But Leo, 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 you're being patient for something, right? You're being patient, patiently waiting. What are you waiting for? Hmm. Your challenge, we'll wait to clarify that. Your challenge is expansion here with the Earth Mother. Manifestation of something you're trying to birth. It could be related to whatever it is you're being patient for. Now, for some of you, I'm getting you could try, you could be trying to get pregnant. And it's been a challenge. If you notice, she's pregnant there. Because whatever the Empress touches turns to gold. It's very fertile energy. So it, it could have been a challenge or it could be a challenge right now trying to get pregnant if you are trying to get pregnant. So things are going slow and this is why you're, this is why the patience here, you're waiting for things to speed up, I'm getting, you're waiting for something to speed up. They, oh, they just said an element of surprise. There's an element of surprise. I don't know what that has to do with. And for some reason, a past situation is coming up with the Five of Cups that is trying to tell you something I'm getting. It's trying to tell you something. And with it coming out, as, with the Two of Cups, it's trying to tell you something about love, perhaps about, because the Two of Cups is somebody coming in. If you're not already with this person, you could be. But there's a past situation that's trying to sort of teach you something or tell. Not even so much teach, it's like tell you something about this love. So, let's see. What is temperance? What is Leo being patient for? Patiently waiting. What are you waiting for? Patiently waiting. Too many. All right, tell me. Judgment, a reunion? 
Innocence of Swords. You're watching something with the Innocence of Swords. Something, someone. You're waiting. Waiting for... Now, Judgment is a rebirth, right? It's not only a reunion, but it is a rebirth. Let's get one more for Temperance. Three of Pentacles is work. Five of Wands. You're patiently waiting for some sort of work to transform that you're watching. And let me see what this Five of Wands is. What is this Five of Wands? It's like movement of cups. So there's this internal struggle. It's either you're watching an internal struggle or you're feeling this internal struggle. Okay, with the Five of Wands. Let's get a Kipper. Journey. Are you waiting to go on a journey? Are you waiting to move? Moving's been coming up for you. Let me get another one. Should get another 10 here too. Ooh, lovers. Uh, are you waiting for somebody at a distance with the lovers card in the journey? Because I feel you've been watching somebody. You're waiting for something to transform somebody's job, something to do with a work situation. Hmm. Making a judgment call with judgment. Are you making a judgment call as far as this journey is concerned? Very interesting, Leo. All right, why is the Earth Mother uh, a challenge? Death. Transformation. Eight of Pentacles. Transformation and work. There's work again. What's up with that? Eight Heart of Wands. All right, clarify uh, death. Ace of Cups and Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, your challenge, you're challenging, um, transforming for you is a challenge right now transforming whether it be you're trying to get pregnant or transformation in a work situation something you're trying to master here transformation in love or something that you love to do with the ace of cups and eight of pentacles courthouse some sort of decision privileged lady yeah see nine of pentacles twice over really are you challenge is it challenging for you to create money here with the nine of pentacles coming out twice abundance right because work keeps coming up is it, are you looking for work? All right, tell me about the movement of pentacles here. The star. The eight of cups. The three of swords. So healing, 
So healing for you, Leo, has been going um, at a snail's pace here. Right, healing of the heart. What is the Eight of Cups here? The moon. Walking away from something. There's a fear about walking away from something with the moon card here and the Eight of Cups. Walking away from a wish. Are you wishing for something that you ultimately have to walk away from, but it's going to break your heart to do so? Thief. Change. Some sort of change is occurring or is going to occur. Family room. Is somebody walking away from you? With the moon in the... Well, if you're with somebody, they might be because the eight of cups in the moon is... It's hidden from you. Somebody walking away. And that's why thief is coming up. So it's like leaving behind this emptiness that you're you're going to have to heal from. But, you know, it's going to go at a snail's pace. But you will transform, though, because you have rebirth here for your overall energy. All right, what about the spirit of pentacles? Six of Wands. Yeah, you're going to overcome this. Whatever this is, justice. You're going to make the right decisions moving forward. Okay? You're overcoming obstacles. And these obstacles need to be overcome to learn the lessons. Right? To learn the truth. Your truth here. And actually, I see you getting... Um, there's a lot of contentment in this. Because you're going to begin to see things from a different perspective. You're also going to be getting a lot of attention. And it could just be recognition for, for I don't know, something that you've overcome. Yeah, sudden wealth here. So a lot of abundance with this, with this truth being found here. It is going to take some time because, you know, you've got pentacles here, but, but there is transformation, a rebirth. Tell me about the Wheel of Fortune, the Seven of Cups. You're going to have a lot of options, Leo. The Innocence of Cups. Wow, Spirit of Cups and Ten of Cups. So, hmm, you may be a little discombobulated with all these options. But within these options lies happiness. So, don't get caught up in the fog of the options here. Somebody may be younger with one of these options coming in. Let's see. Courtship. Told you. Told ya. All right. So tell me about the Two of Cups. Tell me about the Two of Cups. The universe, seven of wands. Ace of swords. Okay. You're clear. All right. With this love that's going to be offering you a new beginning, you're pretty clear about the boundaries that you want to set with this individual. Just be careful you're not, because uh, there's this distrust over here. That you're not um, too paranoid about 
who they are, what they're doing, right? Because of this distrust over here with the thief card. Mature woman. Main male. They see you as very elevated, as very, well, it's like the Six of Wands, which are showing up here, right? So I want to say they're putting you on a, on a pedestal. It's Empress Energy here, this main male. Just masculine energy could definitely be a female, just the masculine energy here. So let's see why the Five of Cups is here, which I find... The Seven of Swords, see? That's that shadiness, the Ten of Pentacles. So this could have been a marriage where somebody was sneaky, 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 shady. So you're looking, yeah, the chariot, marriage. You thought this was a good marriage. You thought that this was, or a long-term relationship, but you thought this was steady. You thought this was victorious until... The rug got pulled out from underneath you. It was just a lot of shadiness. And this caused this thief card, this distrust. Finding out things you did not know. So then this person comes in. And you're very guarded. You're like, hmm, keep, I'm going to keep you at arm's length. Because I need to see what you're doing. I need to make sure that you're not being shady. Sneaky, sneaky. Right? But don't allow this person to suffer. You know, they say the sins of the father, right? Don't allow this person to suffer because of sins of a past person. All right, I'm hearing patterning. It's because it's like programming, right? Even though you consciously know this person is not the past person, it's that program that kicks in. You know, they may do something similar as the past person and then the program kicks in and it's like, hmm, should I trust that? So they're wanting you to be aware of this patterning. All right, so what is your advice here for Leo? Very interesting. What's your advice? Innocence of Wands. Spirit of Wands, they, they're stressing optimism here. Eight of Swords, Heart of Swords, and Five of Swords. You've got to check your ego at the door. Be, be careful about getting too much in your head and seek the truth within your heart space. I'm wondering, I'm going back here, uh, Leo, because I'm wondering about this work thing. Now, it could be you get a job offer or something. It's like you're waiting for something. You're waiting for something regarding work. And it's a struggle. Okay, maybe you're waiting for more money because money's showing up here. But, all right, that had a lot of information in it. All right, so let's get advice here, Leo. Enchantment, we are enchanted when the muses sing the art spirit into us. Do things that are creative, Leo. Change, for a change, do something you usually do a certain way in a different way. So change it up. You do something the same every day, do something different. Change up the energy, Leo. That's what I have for you. I hope that resonates. Please drop a like below. Share and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing the link in the description box, Leo. If you are interested, as there are scammers about the community, and know that you will always see my face in a reading if you order one from me, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube.
Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Have a fabulous week and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.